The following story has been brought to you by storiestoinspire.org. There was, during the Holocaust, a very special Gera Chassid. He was a Chassid of the Imre Emes. His name was Reb Itcha Pluchenik, Zecher Tzadik Livracha. He lived in Antwerp after the war. It was during those dark years, Shnois Ra Inum Ra of the Holocaust, that Rebitcha, being a loyal Ger Chassid, wanted more than anything to be able to tell his Rebbe about what he was going through, the trials and tribulations, the challenges, the torture. He thought to himself, what could I do? So he got some charcoal and he got some little papers and he wrote out a kvittel. He wrote out a little tzettel to his Rebbe and he thought, if I was able to, if I could only get the kvittel to the tzaddik, now I have to do as much as I can. The only thing I can do is write the letter and I'm going to put it in the fence. I have to make my hishtadlus because I want my Rebbe should know what I'm going through. And so, every week, he faithfully wrote out a kvittel, a petek, and he put it in the fence. He did his, what would happen from it. He was zochet to survive the Holocaust. Rebitcha made his way to Eretz Yisrael to once again see the great Ger Rebbe, the Imre Emes. He came to the door of the study of the Imre Emes. And when the Imre Emes saw him standing at the door, he said, Oh, the Alta Kvitl Schreiber, the one who always wrote the Kvitlach. Every Kvitl that he wrote, some way, somehow, nobody knows exactly how, reached the Imre Emes. That is when somebody does something with the purest of intentions, Lishma. Enjoyed this story? Come again. Bring a friend. Stories to inspire.org.